What is going on guys, it is Dazza here and welcome to a brand new video so you may be wondering why I'm staring at my feet. Now there is a perfectly valid reason for that and I will explain to you momentarily why. So before I start this video I want to say a massive thank you yet again to Pangea Estates for providing the land for all of these videos, so appreciated as per usual. So as I said, it's going to be a bit, a bit of a different kind of video. Now, it's going to be a two-part video, so there's going to be part one, which is focusing on the shoes that match with this outfit, and then the second part, which will be the suit itself. Now, I'm not going to show you the suit yet, I'm just, just giving you a bit of a sneak preview here of what, what there is to come. So it's, you know, you can see there's trousers, doesn't mean a thing. So, so I'm going to show you the shoes first. Now, these shoes are called the Triple Monk Shoes. I got the fat pack, as that is what I was sent by the owner of Ascend. Um, and yes, they, they come in Adam, they come in standard sizes, so unrigged so you can resize them. Um, they come in Signature, which is what I'm wearing now as I have a Signature body. They have Slink and TMP, so a huge variety. And these are male shoes, um, male only I think, although you, I guess you could try them on female if you wanted to, but I wouldn't risk it. But as I said, that is all the, the um, bodies that it works for best with. Um, so what I'm going to do now is just show you this shoe. So, I looked at this for hours, honestly, and I can't get over the the pure quality that these shoes are. They look so nice. Slowly go around the outside here. And yes, they are almost made to match this suit, um, um, purposely. But as you can see, they look ultra realistic, which is always good to see in Second Life. Now they do come with these socks here, which I'm circling with my mouse here, and they are changeable. So what I'm going to do is show you a few snapshots of the options available now. So as you can see, those were the options. I'm back at the black ones now, and well, there's a whole bunch of options as you could tell. Now it's pretty easy to use this HUD. You just right click, add it, and you'll have a load of options. Now the top options are the socks, and you've got each shoe part option. So if I change this option here, it'll change this part. Very simple. Uh, with this part, it will change this part here, I think. Perfect. Um, and if I change the bottom part here, it'll change obviously the front, which takes a while to res sometimes. Sometimes you have to scroll out really far and scroll back in in order to see it, but it's fine. And you've got all, which is what I showed you a second ago, the shoes in all with the different varieties of socks. Now, as I said, it's very simple to, it's simple to use HUD, in fact, and well, overall, I adore these shoes. Now, that's pretty much going to sum up part one of this video series. Not really a series, it's just a two-part video, if you want to call it that. But anyway, as per usual, if you have enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. If you want to comment, go ahead, because all comments are appreciated, and be sure to subscribe. But anyway, thank you very much guys for watching, I hope you've enjoyed, and I will see you in the next one.